to our tour. We're finally doing it. <laughs> it's been quite some time, but we're super excited to show you our house and the ocean. This is a sailing catamaran. It's a 2008 Lagoon 420. It's a four bedroom, four cabin catamaran with four heads. Let's get started. We're gonna start with the inside and then we'll go ahead and do the outdoor. Let's go. Get ready. Welcome Let's go to in. Trip. I'm Andrea, that's Alejo, and those are our pairs, Ozzy and Deco. We left the corporate world in Miami to become digital nomads and chase the wind kiteboarding. Join us as we sail an adventure in our dream home, Hakuna. So welcome to our home, guys. One of the main reasons why we chose this catamaran over others is because of the space and distribution. As you can see here, even if you're in the kitchen, you're always connected with anyone sitting in the cockpit this area. There's obviously a lot of counter space here, which is great for us. We have a double sink kitchen. And the reason why we have three faucets is because this one's for fresh water, this one's for drinking water, and this is our test outlet for when we're using our water maker to make water. We have our refrigerator, which is a 220 volt refrigerator, and also our freezer here. This is all storage where we keep our cups, plates, you name it. Here's our silverware and our pans and bowls and any other stuff like that. We also have our cooktop here and our oven. Uh, they're both electrical and we have our dishwasher here and more storage for food and our coffee maker. In this sitting area, there's more storage for food. This is where we keep all our canned foods, anything that's pretty much dry, our soda. Ooh! <laughs> our soda maker is here and here we have more storage where we keep our proteins, uh, bread, all that stuff. Here we keep our fruits and that's about it for the kitchen. We're still here in the saloon so I'm gonna show you here, this place here, very important. So here's our nav station where we have another chart plotter, our VHF and also we got navigation lights and everything, another VHF just in case. Here we have a charging station for all our camera gear, cell phones, watches, and everything. And then here we have a, our table, which we can convert it into a bed, it goes down, and this thing comes, converts into a bed. Also in this seating area, it's all storage. So here we have life jackets and everything. Uh, below here we have an air conditioner. It's a Frigomar 16,000 BTU. Uh, I think the maximum draw is like two amps for that unit, so it's pretty cool. And then there, below there, we have like both parts for service, like oil filters, fuel filters, spare parts. We have some things here, so yeah. So that's it for a saloon. And then here we have our electrical panel, which this section here will be all, all that's 12 volts. And here it's everything that's 230 uh, volts, right? So we have like navigation instruments, lights, anchor light. And then here we have like the, the plugs, our fridge and freezer. Let's go show you the port side of the boat. This is our awesome kite map. This is all the spots that we're going to hopefully visit in the catamaran. So we're super excited to sail there and kiteboard as much as we dreamed about. So let's go show you the stern. We have two cabins here. One in the, obviously one in the bow, one in the stern. Let's go show you the stern first. One of our favorite things about this boat was that the shower is completely separate from the toilet. So with this bathroom doesn't have a toilet because the previous owners removed them and we haven't done it yet, but the shower is in this area here, and then you would have your toilet here, so that's pretty nice. And then the room's super comfortable. It has water view, which is great. You have your closet here. This is where we keep our towels, our bed sheets for pretty much all the rooms. Under this bed, we have the lithium battery, which is uh, 830 amp hours of battery. We also have the engine battery for the port side under the bed. And we have like here the switches for, for, the, for the battery, for, for the engine battery. Also here on the wall, we have our controls for the water maker. 
which is an Aquatec. And the last thing on this bedroom is we have all the breakers for the 220 and the solar power and the inverter. And we have also the breakers for our AC unit. So now let's go to the port bow, the cabin. Hello, me. Okay, before we go to a, to a bow, show you this storage. Here we have the pump for the water maker, all the connections for the water maker, and more storage. Uh, below this baseboard, we have one water tank. And below this one, we have another water tank. So in this hall, we have in total of 134 gallons, like around there, one, like 130. And follow me. So welcome guys to the port bow cabin. So this cabin is really awesome. It's super spacious. You can really walk around, jump on the bed. It's really cool. Um, the, what's awesome about this, about this room is that it separates the shower from the toilet. So here, it's, it's a pretty nice, decent shower. You can fit, you can turn around. It's really nice. The toilet and the sink are also inside the room. They're just right here. And it's still a pretty nice bed, uh, head. It's very spacious. So it's still a pretty nice bed. It's very spacious. The toilet is very comfortable. So it's pretty good. What's special about this room too is that it has our second air conditioning unit. It's a 10,000 BTU AC unit. Um, and we have it right here. And then here we also have just space for people to put their clothes and stuff. We have our closet right here, which is where we keep our blankets. And lastly, we have another little storage right here. That's about it. Let's go back to the saloon. <laughs> Let's show you the starboard side of our boat. So here is one of my favorite things about the boat. This is a painting that we purchased in Sri Lanka during our honeymoon almost four years ago. And we had not had the chance to hang it. We went to different places. They would charge us over 600 bucks to do it. And Alejo just went to Home Depot, put it together. And here it is. We think it looks beautiful. It represents our freedom, the elephants, everything. So just wanted to show you that. Now follow me to the stern cabin of our starboard. Okay, this has to be my favorite room inside the boat and the reason why is because it looks really cool. We have all our kiteboarding gear here. Uh, we have all our kites. At first it was really messy, then we figured out a way. Alejo just hung all the kites around. We have our kiteboards here and that's about it. So below this bed, we have a 12 volt battery bank. So it's separate from the lithium. The lithium always keeps this bank charge and they well we did two banks so just in case if the other one fails we have another bank uh, also we have the starboard engine battery under the bed and here we have the breakers for the wingless battery engine and 12 volt bank this is the starboard head of this the stern head of the starboard side. Uh, here we have an extra freezer. We have all our like paper towels, bathroom things, and like the messy room, dog food, fishing gear, and our cushion. So when we turn our our saloon table into a bed, we put this cushion. Heading into the bow of the starboard side, we have again two water tanks one under this baseboard and one under this one so we have another 130 gallons of water so in total it's like 260 in the whole boat and this is our master bed where the magic happens welcome to our beautiful room this is where we sleep this was special about this room different than the other one we have a tv here we have also chargers for the phones and all that stuff and we have our Amazon TV this is where we keep all of our here the first one is my underwear my bathing suits and Alejo's underwear here we have our closet and this is where we keep all the jackets Alejo keeps all his shirts and my jumpsuits that's about it 
And then on the other side right here, our little storage area. This is where I keep my kiteboarding, swimwear, my gym clothes, shirts, and more shirts. Oh! <laughs> and, okay. and this is all just PJs and stuff. Here we have our first aid. First aid stuff, we have anything from bandits to dog first aid, human first aid, anything you can think about, it's here. And then we also have an extra box right here, the orange one, and it just has more first aid stuff. Just like in the other bow cabin, the shower is separate from the bathroom, our toilet and our, um, and our sink are here. And our shower is right here, just like in the other side. Same size, same, super comfy. And that's, oh no, and one more thing here. We have our third air conditioning unit in this bedroom. And just like in the other bow cabin, we have our air conditioning unit here. It's also a 10,000 BTU air conditioning unit. And this is really this, we have two openings here, one on each side of the bed. Um, and this is where you control the air conditioning unit. So it's pretty cool, comfy, and it's awesome. That's about it. Okay, so now we're gonna show you the outside of our cameraman in this way. So this is our top cockpit area. We have a nice foldable table. And inside here, it's all storage. So here we have our wetsuits, uh, what else, like chairs. Uh, exercise bands and everything. Below that side we have propane tanks for the barbecue and below this side I will show you guys we have important gear behold okay so here we have our 4,000 kilowatt generator. Uh, we have a 50 gallon drinkable water. Our solar inverter. And this is our water maker right here. Our membranes and the motor for the water maker. And here we have our 6,000 watt inverter. Very, very nice. That's it. Let's go show you the helm where we usually are when we're sailing. So let's come up here. We have two engines, two Yanmar 75 horsepower engines, our electric winches here, two manual winches. Um, it's awesome. This helm is pretty cool because we get to sail from here. At no point do we have to go to the other side. We use this manual winch whenever we have to move the traveler or we have to use our jib and we always use our electric winch here because why not right here is where we do everything pretty much this is our chart plotter we have our gps we have an autopilot ais wind speed and obviously the depth and the speed all right let's go to the bow now so that we can show you everything and the cool stuff that we have we have a laundry room guys so we'll show you that Okay, so we are at the bow on our starboard side and what is special about here, here we have our storage. This is where we keep our paddle boards, snorkeling gear, pretty much anything that's related. To, well, also the fenders, we keep our fenders. That's about it. Anything sports related and fenders is in here. Below these cushions, we have all of our lines. So I'll just show you guys real quick. Weak. Weak. <laughs> oh, this is all of our lines right here. We have our trampoline here, we have our anchor, we have an electric winch for our anchor. And here we have cleaning supplies like our brushes, when we have to clean the deck, anything like that is right below here. And last but not least, in our port side, we have more storage. This is where we have our parasailer and what else do we have here? Fenders. Fenders, more buoys, more of that stuff, it's in here. Now let's go to the cool side of our bow. Excuse me, excuse me.
Excuse me, dog. <laughs> okay, this is where our laundry room is at. Perdón. Vete, Eko. Marica, stop it. Okay, if we can just go into the laundry room. <laughs> okay, so here, excuse me. Here is our laundry room. And this is where we keep our gym stuff. So I'll show you guys. All right, so this is where our laundry room is at. It's really cool because we get to open our um, washer. This is not a washer dryer. It's only a washer, but it has that thing where it spins and pretty much the clothes come up dry. And this is where we keep our gym stuff. We have our weights, two weights, two dumbbells. Uh, you can just change the weights. We have this bench, which is cool for gym. And yeah, we just put our clothes here, go out, do the laundry, hang them up there in the stern and we're good and we have all this cleaning supplies here okay guys so i'm gonna show you the solar power of our boat which is up here follow me we have 1770 watts of solar we have two panels here three covering up the thingy and another panel on the other side and that's that's our solar power so we're always powered by solar so thank you so much for watching we hope you liked our home as much as we do we hope you guys enjoy the video don't forget to subscribe to our channel we're always posting awesome videos related to our lifestyle how we live here how we live with the dogs pretty much everything and so yeah just stay in touch give it a thumbs up to the video subscribe hit, hit the, the bell, bell and see you in the next video peace